Hi everyone, Liz here. Thanks for stopping by. So today I've got something a little bit different. Um, I'm not sure whether you've seen these before. I think they're really, really cute. I've got some little framed diamond paintings and they're from different places. So they're slightly different sizes, different ones. Um, the first four I've got are from Amazon um, and I will link them down below. I got them on a special offer. Um, I've got the squirrel, sorry, I think he's a fox, um, a looks like a husky, Alaskan Malamut, uh, a turtle, and then the panda. And then I actually won this one in a competition from Craft Buddy Crystal Art Designs uh, just before Christmas, and that's the unicorn. So I thought we'd have a look at the different ones and see what they're like. Okay, so let's start with the smaller ones first. Just pop those to one side. Okay, we'll start with the panda because he's on there. Let me just see how much he was. Now it says on the website, uh, sorry, on Amazon that these are normally fourteen ninety nine each, but I got him with a coupon for three pound seventy five. So I don't think I'd pay fifteen pound for this. Um, I have opened these and written on the drills what they are because I'm frightened I'm going to get them all muddled up. <laughs> I'm looking and um, you do get lots and lots of different ones um, there's pigs and monkeys and cows and all sorts there so you can get quite a collection if you want to um, put them in children's bedrooms or use them um, for yourself put a nice little row of them come nicely box of the grit as a present um, you do get um, the little tool kit in with them as well. I have taken that out as well. So just a standard tool kit, which is your boat, um, your wax and your pen so you can get started. And that's your little canvas there, look. And it's just then once it's done, going to fit into your little frame. Let's just uh, have a look at the frame. Let's take it out of here and just have a look. They look like really good substantial frames. They've got um, a good thickness to them, a good width to them there. Let's just find my tape measure. So the little canvas, oops, is, where's my tape measure? There it is. So your little canvas is five inches, which is 13 centimetres by ooh, 12 centimetres that way and four and three quarter inches that way okay and the frame is actually six inches by six inches which is 15 centimetres so, and look it's a very nice quality easy to use frame i love these that slide to the edges because those where you have to fold them up i tend to break nails and all sorts doing those it's just a little perspex on the front and this is like a covering that comes off just like a plastic so that you're not getting fingerprints and dust on them so once you're ready you'd peel off from both sides and then your little picture oops that goes in first then your little picture will just Ooh, I've got a slot in there. Does it slot in? We need to take a little bit off that. Yeah, I think it just needs trimming then so that you've just got the actual picture. Oh, yeah, it does say right on the bottom there. I don't know if you can oops, see it. Just a little bit of scissors there telling you to cut it out. So once it's in there, you just pop that back in and fold your little edges. And there you've got your little frame and it's a it stands up so you can have it standing or it has got oh, that's a funny place to have oh no the hooks there oh no that's one of those <laughs> it has got your little hook as well so you can hang it if you want to okay it's got your little hook there so right so yeah that's uh, quite a good fit. make a nice little photograph frame actually if you wanted to use this for something else I mean, these would look nice on uh, little greetings cards if you've got a 6x6 or a 7x7 greeting card. Yeah, that would uh, fit quite nicely on there. That's a 7 inch by 7 inch card there. So you can do some edges. It looks quite nice actually on the white there. 
just makes that pop a little bit. So let's have a look at the drills. Okay, quite a nice amount of drills. Looks like we haven't got a key code or anything anywhere, which I think you've got to look at your packets. Look at uh, where you go with your numbers. These. Oh, no, they haven't got DMC numbers on them. Just looking because we've got some browns books there. Oh, I see. Ah, right. So we've got three different sizes. So it's an all over picture but not all right together and it's different sizes of the same colour. So the black actually has three different size drills on it. So you've got your standard size there, then you've got your slightly larger and then your bigger ones. And then you've got some blue and, uh, yep, some slightly larger blue and the larger blue faceted. And we've got white and like a pearly larger white and green and pink okay and then the next ones are red and green and then a slightly larger green and then a paler green and more of a yellowy green there and then like a goldy yellow okay so lots of drills so how many colors have we got well, I think that's one because it's black. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine with the two greens, ten. So it's ten colours, but three of the colours have got three different sizes. Okay, so not bad at all. Put the back away. So that's the little candle. Okay, let's pop him on one side. Let's have a look at the second one and this is the turtle. Oh, it's quite a holographic sort of sparkly sticker on there. Again this is the same type box, same company I presume. Uh, again just standard tool kit but wax and pen starter kit. Uh, again it's a little frame which is uh, more or less fully covered but all different size drills your little frame again so this is the same size as the panda now on amazon this one says it's nine pounds 89 and again i got a coupon so i only paid four pound 94. look at the drills okay so oh nice colors in this one we have Again, different sizes. So we've got the like champagne gold in a large size, and then the standard. We've got green in the standard size. We've got like a brownie coffee colour in a slightly larger size. A bluey silver, small. Uh, that's your like coffee colour there. Look, that matches that one. Oops, in the small size. We've got like an amber in a small and a large size. We've got a blue, oh nice blue that one, like a sapphire blue. We've got a pinky brown, we've got your standard black, and we've got green in the larger and the smaller. And then that's just a standard size all over silver. We've got your blue in a larger one and a smaller one. And then you yeah, look at that blue, that's superb in a big a medium and a small. So that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight with those, nine with those, ten, eleven, twelve. Twelve colours in this one. So a lot of colours on a very little painting. That is quite a happy little careful there. I like that one. Okay. Get these put away and we'll have a look at the next one. That's the title. I'll just get these put away and we'll have a look at the next one. Okay, so the next two are a slightly larger one and these come in these plain cardboard boxes with your little sticker on. And this one is the Husky. 
And again, standard tool kit, wax, boat and pen. Okay, so it's a slightly larger frame and a larger picture. Again, it's your all over, but with different size. I do like these. They're just that little bit different. It's like doing sort of a, similar to a full drill canvas, but it's not full drill because it's not all one lined up with the other, but you are covering the whole canvas. Okay, again, you need to cut these out to get them into the frame. So let's have a look at this frame. It's the same as the ones that we've just done for Turtle and Panda. But again, as I say, just that slight bit bigger. Same backing with your little hanger there if you want to put it on the wall. And just your little twisty um, fasteners at the back. And your piece of Perspex. Quite good actually these if you've got dogs or kids around and you don't want glass frames. You could use these for pictures. Again, that will just peel up there on both sides so oh no this has only got it on one side so you've only got the cover on one side oh, you better keep my fingers off that one then and then you pop that in there once you've cut it out pop your picture in and then put your back on okay so let's have a measure and see how big these actually come out at Okay, so the drilling area, it says 15 by 15 on the top there. So let's see. Yep, it is 15 centimetres, which is six inches. By, yep, 15 centimetres, six inches. And the frame is seven inches, which is 18 centimetres. Yep, seven inches, 18 centimetres. Okay, so that's just slightly bigger frame just to compare to the other one that's your smaller frame there look it would just fit inside It'd make quite a nice uh, set and that's your size of your pictures there just to compare okay so say so they're a good about what is that is that about an inch let me just have a look it's about three quarters of an inch, two centimetres there in thickness on those. And they do stand up nice and substantial. Okay, and again, your canvas, if you're wanting to, you could put this on an eight by eight, or again, will fit on a seven by seven inch card. I think I would more put that on an eight by eight so that you get a bigger frame around the edges if you're gonna use it as a card. Okay, let's have a look at these drills. Yeah, he's quite cute, isn't he? Nice red collar on him. Uh, my daughter actually has an Akita, um, an American Akita, and he's lovely. He's called Jensen, and um, uh, similar to a husky with the, the double coat and everything on them. Really, really friendly. Um, she did have a, a male and a female, uh, and uh, had two lots of puppies a few years back, and that was great fun. Puppies everywhere. wonderful okay so let's have a look at these so we've got like a, a ready orange color a pale blue and then a medium blue and a larger blue that's going to be all of your background around there and his eyes and then we've got black in the standard size and the larger size and then white in the standard size, and then oh, they're a slightly different colour. It's more of a creamy white, and that's a white white. <laughs> and they're like a, they've not got facets on, they're just a half sphere type. Okay, so that's the stick. He's really sweet, I like him. It's like a slew of projects to do these. I mean, if you want to get somebody that's not done diamond painting before, or one of the children just to have a go and there's something really nice to have a look at and have a go at okay so that's him and then next one's the fox again from the same company and um, just check what price this was they were all bought at slightly different times because i've got slightly different coupons for them so the fox 
is normally eleven ninety nine, and I got him on a coupon for five ninety nine. Oh, he's sweet. That's really good. Those colours look really good there. So that's the canvas for him, and again the same frame as the husky. And let's get into these. There's a lot of tinkering on this video, I do apologise. So we've got some standard greens there, they must be for your leaves. And we've got white and black and your amber colour in the medium size and the standard size, which they must all be your little fox. Got green, yellow, pink. And then red. Oh, so the background's all going to be red then. Wow. Okay, so we've got red in the larger, the medium and the small. Okay. They look quite good quality. Nice little kits. So lovely presents. We'll pop this one. There. Oops. Oh, don't forget the green ones. Don't want to miss those the way okay right and i'll just get the last one and i'll be back okay and the final one this one is from a uk company it's craft buddy which is crystal art and this is called a crystal art frameable and they are seven pounds 99 again lovely box there uh, it says age six plus but i've had um, a three-year-old helping me with these obviously just watch out if you are uh, doing them with children, uh, younger children. It's a party unicorn. It says it's approximately six by six inches, 16 by 16 centimetres. And it gives you all your instructions on the back on diamond painting and your frame there as well. So let's get into this one and have a look. Okay, that's your box. I do like the box. I do like... Uh, being able to see what's in there. Oh, nice little canvas. And this is your inside. Okay, let's have a look. It's quite a long uh, video of this one. I hope you've stayed with me. So, we've got uh, a toolkit which has a three play set and quite a nice amount of baggies there and wax. So, again, good to get you started. Everything you need there for your diamond painted. Got ooh, lots of different colour drills there. Okay. And we've got the instructions there telling you it's a crystal art frameable kit. What's included, your frame, your tray, a pen, your wax, your bags of crystals and your frame. And it's a nice little canvas. Let's have a look at this frame. Oh, this is nice. This has got like a, a bevel on the edge. See if we can get into this. Oops, just use my scissors there and just have a look. Yeah, it's a uh, more rounded frame. Now, then, this one hasn't got perspex on the front. This one, you do just put it straight onto the board. So, let's have a look again. Oh, it's your nice springs. Easy to get out, I do like those. Yeah, there's no perspex with this, so it is just the canvas. So you will just put the canvas. Yeah, but I mean, it's already pre-cut. It's just that it's got the plastic on that it's not laying quite as flat. And then we'll just pop that on top there, fasten it in. And you will just have your drills on display. So it might be worth framing, uh, sorry, sealing these, uh, depending on where you're going to have them. But yeah, okay, so let's do a bit of measuring. Just uh, pop that back out there. And pop the frame back in. It's funny how different companies do a similar thing, but all slightly different. So let's measure the little canvas and see if we are the size that it says. 
and this one is a partial it's uh, not the background that you're actually popping drills on it is just going to be the little unicorn and the balloon although if you wanted you could put some little sparkles on the dots as well just add some extras if you've got some left over so let's have a look so the canvas is uh, yep it's 15 centimeters by 15 centimeters which is about six and a half inches by six and a half inches and the frame size is 19 centimeters which is seven and a half inches by 19 centimeters good size frame so there's no cover on the front of this one so you would have to be careful with your painting probably seal it okay so let's have a look at the rules Right. Okay, this looks like this is a mixture of specials. Oh, look, we've got some little, oh, look how tiny they are. Can you see those Just really, really tiny little gold stars? Wow. So, have we got a key code somewhere for this? Or do we just, oh, I see, oh, I see. yeah, it's numbered on here. So you can see where the stars go there. That is there. Yeah, there are E's. So yeah, there's a key code. Yeah, that's a very pale E on there. Okay. So let's have a look at these drills. But I've certainly got plenty of them. Uh, there's no DMC numbers on them, unfortunately. But uh, some nice drills. Looks like really good quality drills. Very sparkly. So we've got a lovely purple, nice bright yellow. The grey, which looks like that's what's going to go on the unicorn. The pink, which will be... It's always quite a rainbow, isn't it? It's uh, rainbowy colours. The pink there, the green, blue, white. And then your gems are your champagne gold, slightly paler. And then your lilacs there, which will all intermingle with uh, your normal drills. So, yeah. Certainly plenty. What have we got? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven colours and the stars and the specials. So again, that's quite a lot of colours and certainly plenty of drills for just doing this little drill area. Now I'll definitely be adding some extra little ones on there. Again, you, you could use that on a greetings card or you can use it on your frame, uh, whichever way around you want to do it. So pop those on one side there let's just have a quick look at what we've opened so we've got one sort of frame there that one's from craft buddy and then the next frame which is slightly smaller and then the very small frame and they're from amazon and then we had our panda and our turtle which were the small ones and then the husky and the fox and then last but not least, our little unicorn. Okay, so five little picture kits, uh, little easy to do um, paintings, nice for children, nice for yourself to do. I think I might have a go at doing one of these. It does uh, get me thinking, oh, I could just do one of those when I see uh, my unboxings when I do these. So, okay, well, if you've enjoyed what you've seen, please give me a like down below and subscribe if you want to see further notifications of when the next videos come out so thanks for stopping by bye for now